Hey guys, William Warfield here with you one more time. King of Stream is, uh, I'm going to show you how to use Live Score app with Wirecast. So, this is how you do it using Wirecast. So, we got our uh, Live Score app uh, software, it's up. We got our graphic already made here, as you can see. Um, so, how do I get my graphic? Well, first off, let me let me show you this. Let me show you that you can control your graphic here. There's a controller uh, to where you can, you know, do ball strikes, all that good stuff. So we'll start a fresh game. There you see top of the first. Um, but uh, you can control ball strikes. It'll keep up automatically with the with the pitch count as long as you choose it to do that way. Um, but but you can see that uh, we're able to control all the functions of a baseball game right here including the pitch count uh, men on bases as you see as uh, I'm doing that uh, of course your outs you're able to control that as well uh, your innings uh, you can change side it changes from top to bottom so there you have it uh, as far as controlling the graphic but uh, and there's also iPad apps that you can get as well so uh, we highly recommend those for additional charges uh, you're able to get those onto your iPad hand it over to a student intern uh, with little to no experience and they'll be able to control it really really easily but uh, how do we get this into to Wirecast well the solution is simple I'm gonna minimize this program it can run in the background um, especially if you're using the iPad app it's it's very easy to use again uh, but uh, this is Wirecast here and uh, basically in live score we'll pull that back up here for a second but you come over here to edit you go to settings and you could tell it right here when you go to output rendering um, you could tell it where to put your image file um, so we got our image file set to our desktop we'll go ahead and save that um, we want to make sure that under output settings up here that image output is selected and that generate image um, is being done right now. So we're going to minimize this as well. Uh, go back to Wirecast and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the graphic and I'm going to drag it into Wirecast. Make sure you get that little level, uh, excuse me, yellow line there uh, lit up so that uh, you're able to do so. So I click on it, and well, the uh, the graphic is right where I don't want it to be. So how do I change that? Well, I'm gonna hit this little gear icon, this little uh, gear icon right there. And I'm gonna hit Edit Shot. So we're gonna Edit Shot, and then I'm gonna be able to just drag it where I want it to go. So I'm gonna drag it about right there. I think that's fine. Now I'll retake it here, um, and there you see. Um, so I've got my uh, we got we're using a viewcast card. We also got a deck link hooked up into um, our wirecast here, but but we got uh, Osprey card with the color bars there, just so that you can get an idea. That's how you uh, do your overlay graphic there. So you want to you want to bring it on the top line uh, line number one. Um, line number five is always got to be your video cameras um, if you're using more overlay so with Wirecast you can go four overlays on top of your video overlay which is number five so uh, just to keep that in mind but uh, there you see it I've got it uh, I've got it selected it's over my color bars which means if I had a video signal there it would be over my video uh, just to take it off you could do this um, just go to blank shot and then to bring it back up you just click it back again so that's how you use live score app with Wirecast again just drag it into your uh, number one there uh, timeline and uh, just uh, you know position it where you want to using the gear icon under edit shot and you'll be all set to use live score app with Wirecast and um, let me show you uh, real quick we'll show you um, the website that uh, live score app pass let me pull this up bear with me just for a second I want to show you there so you can get a look at the different score bar uh, scoreboards that they ha offer we'll do that here in just one second we are recording this live just so you know that's why it's taking just a second to bring up the website but uh, 
we'll get that going here. All right. So I've got that over here, and this is what their website looks like. So um, basically any sport that you want, you'll be able to control it. It's got different controllers. Again, I, I suggest highly the downloading the iPad apps uh, for an additional charge. Now, the main software, um, you'll pay $9.99 for that, um, but, but then uh, each iPad app to control it. Um, you know ranges in price so um, but but there is always the free controller um, that you can use let me show you that one more time before we get into their website here um, so I'll come back over here to their um, to the live score app here and then uh, I'm just going to come over here to um, view and then sports controller and then this this one's always free to use so you'll be able to uh, you know to to do all the different functions of a baseball game to keep up with the score. Um, it's a little hard on a producer if you do it that way. I, again, I highly suggest your uh, the iPad app. It, it'll be a lot easier to have somebody else uh, take care of that role of the broadcast. But um, we'll minimize that again, and I'll fade back over here to the website. And uh, just on their website here, um, you can see the different sports that they that they. Uh, have stuff for so this right here is the multi-sport graphic then uh, baseball graphics they've got several different one of those this is a little bit different one than what we're using tonight um, but they've got several different ones of those uh, basketball that is a beautiful uh, overlay graphic right there for basketball and uh, you know they've got them for all kinds of different ones even MMA uh, mixed martial arts, they've got it for that. Tennis, soccer. Soccer is pretty popular throughout the world, so let's check, take a look at that. Um, they've got different ones, again, that you can that you can use, as you can see there. So, um, again, this, this software is amazing. Live Score app. You can get to their website by going to live-score-app. That's A-P-P dot com. And uh, definitely... Take it for a test drive. You, you get a 14-day trial period to test it out and uh, use it on your programs. Well, that's going to be it for this tutorial. William Warfield, the king of stream here for you as we continue to bring you more tutorials here uh, for everybody to check out. Thanks for tuning in.